certainly was on top of his game last night. We'll see how tonight goes for these two teams, the Bulldogs and the Tigers. Game two from Amsoil Arena here in Duluth. Thanks for being with us. Wisdom off the opening draw. Shoot strong guy, gets that puck deep into the zone and this creates a little offensive chances here for them. Clevin spins one to the middle and a forehand backhand move for Bettens is turned aside by Emberico. A pretty good save, Bettens was in. His wisdom to the far side. This is Veremyev, Lava stays on side at the line. Tipped in front, the rebound cleared away. On the doorstep was Lava for Colorado College. Well, a great back check and a good stick by 39, McMenamin. Another turnover here in UMD, outnumber chance. The other way, Loney has Olsen with him as he crosses the line. Loney fires, he scores! Carter Loney, a shorthanded goal! And the Bulldogs lead it 1-0. Wow, how big is that? Just as that pedally expired, not sure it'll officially be a shorty or not, but Carter Loney, one of these top pedally killers for UMD, just, the, again, what to what you... Again, nice to see 27 in white, Blake Biondi right in the mix of things. Now a turnover, out in front they score. Tyler Coffey, a one-timer from the slot. A turnover turns in to the equalizing goal, it's 1-1. Had some words for the officials. I'm not sure if they're talking about the, the Biondi, kind of that situation in front on the tackle. The linesman happened in front of the goal, is driving to the net. In front of the top was uh, Clevin. It comes free to Bettens. He scores. Roofed it. Tyler Bettens. It's 2-1 UMD. Well, it was nice to see the big guy get rewarded here. You can see him. He's just being patient. What a play in front there. As it, the puck gets kicked over to him by Kyler Clevin, who we've talked about being pass. That was... Beremyev, now a shot from Andrews, he scores! 0.2 seconds on the clock, and Nicholas Andrews has tied the game at two. UMD had possession of the puck, it was Aaron Pionk who kind of coughed it up and it created this turn of change of possession for CC, and they get it back to the point, and the puck goes to the net, somehow finds its way the far side, Goats. Goats bothered from behind, can't clear the zone. Veremyev, his pass behind Millar, takes it on the backhand and stays call way out on the top of his crease, makes the stop for UMD. Well, different look here for UMD, this line is to play. Pion moves it ahead to Bettens, three on two, four on two as they enter. Goats walks in, a save in Barrico. Bettens picks up the rebound. UMD buzzing in the final minute. Can they find the win? He's wrapped up by Foley. Now look out, a two on one for CC. Laba has Link with him. Laba in the circle, fires, he scores. Noah Laba, the overtime winner. Three to two, the final. CC gets the split. We've talked about Noah Laba all, all weekend long. Hadn't had much to show for it, but he's a pretty highly skilled player. A big, big guy with a good shot, and he just comes in and he just rips it short side over the glove of stage call for the victory. Really pretty similar to the play we saw Ben Steves get the winner on last night. You get the